From under the ground and into fresh air for what could be the first time in a century, these University of Idaho students are looking for history right in their own backyard. Who said all classwork has to be clean and tidy? In Moscow, it's all about getting your hands dirty for a reason. But you find those little moments, these little glimpses of moments. A type of physical learning that can come with a very real reward. Oh, this could have been from like the, the middle of the, the last century or whatever. This month, close to two dozen U of I students are digging at Moscow High School. It's part of an anthropology class, but also a chance for them to find real history. It fits into kind of the story of Moscow being a town where public education is really important. Professors say the high school sits on one of the oldest developed sites in Moscow. This building is 80 years old, but before that there were homes here when the town was first settled. We're looking for the traces of human activity and human history. Findings so far include essentially old garbage, bottle caps, glass, buttons and dishes. This group hopes something big is buried near here. But in digging for treasure, they're also hoping to inspire others. The dig is open to members of the public, and some high school students are also joining in as a learning experience. They want them to know that archaeology is far from dead. And so kind of this is broadening the students' horizons of kind of what is available to them. Because before these students, there were learners here over 100 years before, ones who possibly left behind clues of what their Moscow lives were like. In Moscow, Taylor Vido, Cram 2 News.